Hello, Hello YouTube. YouTube. Welcome back to our kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking a tasty snack which will be chewy oak bars. These Stay are the ingredients that we will be using. One cup of dried cranberries, one cup of rough chopped almonds, a half a cup of granulated sugar, two-thirds cups of honey, a pinch of kosher salt, one-third cup of sunflower seeds, and five cups of quick oats, and two cups, I'm sorry, two sticks, which is about one cup of unsalted butter. Let's get started. What we're gonna use is a nine by 13 inch baking pan. It's covered with parchment paper, and we have a little bit hanging over each side. We're gonna preheat our oven to 325 degrees, and let's get on to the next step. Okay, we're gonna add our butter. Our oh. honey. Well, honey, you can go ahead and put the sugar in. And our sugar. And we're putting this in over a medium low heat. I'm going to take a wooden spoon. Oh, you want to let it melt a little bit more than that, but... I'm going to let it melt down. Uh, meanwhile, we're going to have to get our oats ready. Here's our five oats. We've already put four cups of oats in the pan. And we have the... Um, we just add our other cups of oats. We're yeah. going to be adding our sunflower, sunflower seeds. seeds. And then we're going to add our chopped almonds. And we're gonna add our cranberries. Another thing we forgot well, to mention is we're gonna need a about a tablespoon, tablespoon of salt. I mean, uh, flour. A tablespoon of flour. flour. Just put that in. And remember, we need a pinch of kosher salt. Okay. So now the next thing we're gonna do is um, kind of just mix this up a little bit. Honey, you want to take care of mixing this a little bit while I check on the butter mixture. We've been heating our honey and butter mixture for about four minutes now, and it's ready to be blended so with the now, rest of the ingredients. Hubby is pouring in our honey and butter mixture. Okay, and what we're gonna do here is we're gonna just fold it in with the oaks. Honey, you keep reaching for this. You want to do it? I'm doing it okay? Yeah, you're doing good. And I'll do it if you want. All right. We have covered our mixture with the butter and honey. And now we're adding it to the parchment paper. And what I'm going to do now is kind of gently, just gently press it into the paper, into the pan. Just like that, we're going to just kind of press it and spread it. It smells good. It does. It smells good. We have um, pressed the mixture into the parchment paper. We're going to actually go ahead and put it in the oven. And we're going to bake it for about 30 to 35 minutes. And just kind of flatten it out here there. Okay, baby. You can go and take it to the oven. So now we have taken the uh, oat bar out of the oven. And we're now moving it to a cooling rack. That way it can cool. Okay, so we have it now on the cooling rack. We're gonna give it a few minutes to cool. Once it cools, we're gonna move it to a cutting board and we're gonna cut it into pieces. Okay guys, we'll be back. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and give these a good little chop up. And I'm just using something real crazy looking. It's a meat cleaver, only because it's kind of easier for me to give it an even chop. Let's 
kind of making lines and then I'm gonna go straight across and you can do this of course with a regular knife. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and plate these up. And thank you so much for joining us today. And try these, they taste delicious.